You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. I'm back. Rudrance for our Black and White Sports. My goodness, we got Jesse Liminaire, who played for the Detroit Lions, passes away suddenly, very young. Henry Anderson, Carolina Panthers player that at 31 had a near fatal stroke not too long ago. Uh, we had, of course, very publicly on Monday Night Football, came the biggest story of this month, biggest story in sports in quite some time. DeMar Hamlin dropping right there on Monday Night Football of cardiac arrest. My God, we still don't know exactly what happened there. And now we have this news, which is just unbelievable. It truly is. 35 years old, Chris Baker, he nearly dies. This is crazy. Uh, we don't know exactly what's going on. Certainly starting starting to have a lot of suspicions. A lot of ideas about what might be happening. Ex-NFL player suffers near a fatal stroke at 35 years old. Breitbart. Former Washington Redskins lineman Chris Swaggy Baker suffered a shocking and nearly fatal stroke at the age of only 35. Recording a message from his hospital bed, Baker told fans in an Instagram story Wednesday that he nearly died from the medical emergency, but added that it looks like God isn't done with him yet. Thank God. That's awesome news. Fantastic news. Quote, tell your loved ones you love them. My life almost ended two days ago, Baker said in a video, according to TMZ. Quote, I can't believe I had a stroke, but God was not done with me yet. He said, wearing his hospital gown and trust up with medical monitoring devices. There's the commander's tweet right there. There's former Washington DT, Chris Baker. Good God. Let's just flip over here. Let's just take a quick look. I can't believe I had a stroke, but God was not done with me yet. My God. Unbelievable. Absolutely crazy that this happened out of nowhere. The player's mother told TMZ that the stroke was, quote, very serious and that he required emergency surgery when first brought to the Connecticut hospital. However, she also noted that the doctors are encouraged by the, quote, miracle recovery that he is already making. Baker posted another video with a brief snapshot of him in the hospital in a wheelchair. The defensive tackle played for the Redskins from 2011 to 2016 and recently renamed the Commanders, posted a get well message on Instagram posts featuring praying hands and hearts. Baker also briefly uh, played briefly for the Denver Broncos, Tampa Bay Buccaneers, and the Miami Dolphins during a nine-year career. I thought to myself, I was like, I know he played for more teams than that. Starting at Penn State, Baker finished his college career at Hampton University, where he recorded 214 tackles and 12 sacks before signing with the Broncos in 2009. He spent only one season with the Broncos and Dolphins before six seasons with the Redskins. Sounds like he definitely got his legs under him once he got to Washington. And uh, I remember Chris Baker. I mean, I, I remember Chris Baker playing on those teams. And at 35 years old, just suffered a random, near-fatal stroke. You know, I just did a video earlier about uh, former Major League Baseball player, very outspoken, Aubrey Huff, uh, played for the great players for the Rays, good player for the Giants, two-time World Series winner, uh, was questioning things around DeMar Hamlin. A lot of people have a lot of questions right now. Seeing a lot of young people dying quickly or having these like near-fatal strokes like Henry Anderson with the Carolina Panthers. I've never seen anything like this. I have not. I mean, look, 
This channel has been going. We're going on almost a three-year anniversary at this point. And um, actually, we are over a three-year anniversary. I can tell you what happened during the first 12 months, 18 months, that we didn't see anything like this. The first 24 months really didn't see anything like this. We're talking about in like the last two months. Yikes. Tell me what you think, black and white sports supporters. Also take note, I give the Washington Redskins, they will always be the Redskins as far as I'm concerned, and Dan Snyder some credit for not uh, holding back. Prayer is seems to be making a more public comeback. So um, I feel at least some... Some hope that we're turning the tide there. Maybe. Possibly. Uh, Dr. Fauci, would you like to offer up any anything on all this stuff going on? Just wondering. Oh, is this on? Now, you are going to feature dinosaurs on your dinosaur ride, right? Fauci. Peace. I'm out. Till next time. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.